Hey guys, this is Kyle from Vanover Customs. Today I'm gonna to be showing you how I do internal threading on my lathe using this Mari Tool floating tap holder. There are many ways to do it. Sometimes I do this because it's a little bit quicker than doing single point threading. Let's get started. We went ahead and drilled the hole. This is 1018 cold rolled steel. And then we followed up with a countersink bit to give a really nice chamfer on the inside. What that does is just help the tap start nice and easy. My lathe is a clausing 13 inch cold chester and I'm using this BXA style tool post. If some of you guys notice, I do have this riser block on there. That just gives me a little bit more height adjustment on each of the tool holders. We're gonna be using this one inch tool block and I'm gonna be putting it on this side here. It's a BXA-4D if you guys are curious. Then we're gonna take this Mari tool tool holder and slide it in here and then tighten it down. Now this is an ER32 collet on the end, so you'll wanna get the appropriate collet for your tap size. I already have it set up, it's a 3 8 And then we're using a half 13 tap. We'll go ahead and get this slipped in here and then tighten this down. I got you zoomed in here and we're ready to do the tapping. It's a half 13 Cleveland spiral flute tap. I find that you really need to use a high quality tap or else you'll just have problems breaking. We're gonna lube this up with some anchor lube. You could use pretty much anything. I just like the color of it and I'm trying it out. I'm gonna go ahead and shift my lathe here into slow gear and we'll put it in forward and get going. Now we will reverse out. I don't know if you can see those threads, but they turned out really, really nice. And that was pretty dang quick. All right, guys, that's it. It's super, super simple. All you need is one of those floating tap holders and you need to make sure it's set up right and you can be tapping internal holes pretty quickly and efficiently and get great results. Hope you enjoyed the video and we'll see you in the next one.